engine brake is on. It's a train brake. This is hand, that's, this is release. That's handle off. That's lap. That's service. You can see it. You can watch it. Brake down. Like if I want to make a 10 pound reduction, I'll get down 80 pounds. Say, and I want to, then I just go like that and close the brake pipe off and it'll hold it an 80 pound or 10 pound reduction. Alright, now the other kicker is I made the reduction. I'll show you now. Right now the engine brake is on, but I still got 30 pounds of the brake cylinder. So if I got to release them, because I don't want flat spots, so you just push down on the handle and it takes the air off of the cylinders on the engine brake. Yeah, now you know why these guys wear air protection. Now say I got some dope runs in front of me with a car. Yeah. You ever been in one of these when they go in emergency? No. no. That's emergency. Now this is your reverser, forward, neutral, reverse. This is this this engine here has uh, automatic transition. In other words, if uh, like driving a car, yeah. uh, like if you if you start out with a heavy tonnage train, you might be pulling like uh, 13, 1400 amps. So what happens is as your train speed increases, this will automatically sense the biggest shift in the circuit through the traction motor. That's about the easiest way to explain it. Yeah. In other words, as your, amp as your amperage drops off, your voltage picks up, and then there's a relay that'll sense it's an automatic, take it like from series and put it in, uh, it might start out like series, and then uh, General Motors has what they call series parallel shunt. Alco has a different term. But basically, you're just changing traction motor circuits yeah. as your speed increases and less, and less draw and less work on the generator and so on and so forth. And the engine runs switch down, so it won't advance, but yeah. the RPMs won't come up. Now, the other is to shift them. You'd have to watch it probably with time, you'd get used to it, but you watch your amp meter, but it was a pain in the neck. I think I'm right on this. Say you'd go to position one, now you're watching your amp meter drop back off from high amperage. Now you got to close the throttle. Say you're in the eighth notch starting out. Yeah. Say you'd be like this in your eighth notch, wide open, yeah. out of the back of the fifth notch, make your transition, and then open the throttle again, which was a pain in the neck. Yeah. 